Hi, this is Dr. Johnny Bowden, author of The 150 Healthiest Foods on Earth. Last time we talked about organic, I told you about the 12 most sprayed plants that had the most pesticides and the ones to avoid, but there's really a lot more to talk about when it comes to organic. Plants that are grown on commercially fertilized ground are often inferior to organic for a number of different reasons. The first is, the fertilizers make them grow faster. That's what industrial fertilizers do. But there's a problem with that. That means the roots have less time to accumulate all the major minerals besides the big three that they just need to live. The big three that they need are nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. But there's a whole wealth of other minerals that are important also. And if you have plants growing too quickly, they don't have time to really amass those minerals from deep into the soil. They have easy access to those three, which means that they develop kind of shallow roots. They don't really have to dig down deep to look for things. So they have less access to all these rich soil minerals. There's also less biological activity in the soil, and that plays a big role in the health of the plant. Less of mycorrhizae, which is a, a fungi that works with the plant root system, uh, exchange of nutrients for an exchange of sugar. And they don't have access to this when they grow these little shallow roots. So when a plant is grown organically, it doesn't get all that industrial help from fertilizers and pesticides. So it has to defend itself naturally. It kind of has to develop karate skills. It learns how to fight off the predators. Well, when it does that, it develops all kinds of phytochemicals and antioxidants and, and things that can help you when they get into your diet. So there's a lot more reasons to buy organic than might meet the eye. And we'll be talking about it many times again in the future on these videos. This is Dr. Johnny Bowden for Eat, Drink, or Die. Sign up for my free video series, Seven Nutrition Lies That Are Making You Sick and Fat at johnnybowden.com.